like to play our little game of hide and seek amongst the pumpkins. Hello again. Can you help me? Ah, Sir Nicholas's young friend. Has he abandoned you? Not at all. I need to speak to Richard Jackdaw. Sir Patrick said his head might be around here somewhere. Indeed it might be. Hmm. It is a bit unorthodox to include a mortal, but if you do wish to speak with him... Oh, why not? You can speak with Jackdaw if you can find his head amongst these pumpkins. Not just once, but five times. Good old Dumfrey will move the head to a different spot each time you find it. Those are the rules. What say you? If that's what I need to do to speak to Jackdaw, I'll do it. Marvellous! Of course, a mortal holding a wand has an advantage over us ghosts. You can simply blast away to your heart's content. Remember, the game's not over until you find him five times. Begin! Cast away until you find him. I could do that too if I had a wand. And a body. Discovered already? Looks like we need to find another pumpkin to hide in, eh, Jack? Whatever you say, Dumfrey. This is not my finest moment. You make this look easier than it's supposed to be. I could do that too if I had a wand and a body. I'm glad I won't be the one to clean up this mess. I could do that too if I had a wand and a body. Who would have thought a mortal would be so good? Long now, I won't find you. And then I will be the one to clean up this mess. Rebellion. I could do that too if I had a. Is it over yet? Are we still going? I've never seen it played like this. How delightful. I could do that too if I had a wand and a body. Oh, what fun! A student is playing! Well, good job, I suppose. But we're not through with you. I'm 
then I won't be the one to clean up this mess. <laughs> Of course, having a wand served you well. Still, I believe congratulations are in order. Not too bad for a mortal. Now, say what you need to say to old Jack Door here, hmm? You've earned it. Nicely done. But what's going on? You're not a member of the Headless Hunt. No, I'm not. Sir Nicholas said you might know the location of some pages I'm looking for. Merlin's beard. I know precisely the ones you mean. I pinched them from Peeves. How could I forget? The map on those pages led me to my demise. I was not ready for what awaited me in that cave. The pages are likely still mouldering away with my, uh, uh, remains. Quite a final adventure, I must confess. The pages are why you lost your head. And I must visit a cave and search for your corpse. Yes. <sighs> You'd think a decapitated ghost would get used to the word corpse. Say, here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you where to go? What will I find in the cave? Aside from my mortal remains, if I remember correctly, some treasures, a magical bridge. But what kind of an adventure would it be if I spoiled the surprises for you? Did someone in the cave cut off your head? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze, after which I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, when you visit, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's likely to cause the most chaos. I found them after he ran riot through the library. Doubt he even noticed they were gone. I need those pages, so I suppose I'd better meet you. Thank you. Not to worry. I'll just need to be reunited with my body first. But Dumfrey can handle that. See you at the forest's edge.
I hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. What is it? I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. I'm not sure what that means, but it sounds horrible. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Uh, as you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. Expelliarmus, you seem to have the right end of the stick. But keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder.
<laughs> a pop of heat could deal a bigger blow. Expel the office. How dare you! Have you seen? Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. Just like a Gryffindor to brave the forbidden forest in pursuit of adventure. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a Rebellio. Lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Is that Latin? Or Greek? Hmm. Rebellion. Nothing to do now but keep going. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Rebellion! Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. There it is, just as Jackdaw described.
Revelio. Intramuros. Aren't you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Yeah. We'll report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Doris led me. How big this place is. I can shoot the symbol, but it doesn't stay lit for long. visitors down here. Any of my spells will help me through this. I'm not going to touch that. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go.
here. A platform ought to be able to float straight to me. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Akio! wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Rebellion. Incendio! Expelio! Protego! Stupid! Accio! Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. It's a good thing Jack Daw didn't fall down there. Akio! Incendium. Aki. 
Leviosa. Expelliarmus. Predigo. Leviosa. Incendio That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's Rebellion. Expelliarmus. Accio. Levioso. Accio. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be?
Akio. An untouched chest. Teratol wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. It's almost complete. More spiders. These corpses were bad in the jungle. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Potato. Stupid. Imagine the multiplied since Jackdaw came this way. Rebellion. Glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Closer to Jackdaw's remains and those pages. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Here it is the map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? Protego! Stupid one! Expelliarmus! Akio! Levioso! Stupid one! Expelliarmus! Incendio! Levioso! Let me 
incendio. Expelliarmus. Levioso. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What is this place? Can it be? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention, and might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place.
I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? 